Hello everybody. So I'm pretty much standing in the parking lot of Spooky Nook Sports Complex and the warehouse at the Nook. So I'll be giving you a little bit of a tour of this whole facility, uh, mostly focusing on the warehouse at the Nook, the hotel portion of this uh, complex, and I'll have some clips of the uh, arena itself, the Spooky Nook Sports Arena just so that you can get a feel on the scale and scope of this uh, venue. At any time during this little tour that I'm giving, if you're interested in learning more about the Spooky Nook Sports Complex, I will have a link to their website in the description down below. Also, uh, check out Lancaster Archery if you're looking to uh, you know, maybe participate in the Lancaster Classic uh, next year or in the following years. So now, let's enter the Warehouse Hotel at the Nook. So go through the first set of doors here, and we're gonna turn to the left, and that is one entrance into the restaurant, the uh, fork and pallet. And then we're gonna enter the second set of doors, and here is the lobby. Quite a lobby, uh, very nicely decorated. Uh, you got a set of stairs heading upstairs, uh, and that gives you access to all the floors. Front desk is over there. Uh, another look at the lobby, nice TV there. Uh, I think it's a fireplace in the corner there. And, uh, you know, just a nice feel. The, the lobby was very new, and uh, let's go and summon the elevator. All right, the elevator's here. Nice elevator, only one elevator. So the stairs is sometimes a good option, especially, you know, with all of our archery equipment. And now we're on one of the floors. Uh, this happens to be the third floor, and my hotel room happens to be the hotel room at the very end. So you get a nice, uh, you know, view of all the rooms and everything else going on. A lot of people were moving in because uh, this was the official practice day of the tournament, so a lot of people were showing up for the uh, Lancaster Classic on this day. And as I got to the room, I whipped out my key card and they have a really cool way of opening your door. Boom, it's all electronic. Open it up and you're good to go. Now here's another cool thing, watch this. Yup, the key card controls the lights, uh, keeps the place a lot greener. That way you're not leaving lights on as long as you take out your key card. Next up, a little look at one of the uh, like waiting areas. You can just sit and relax. And we're gonna continue on to the ice and vending laundry area and of course the staircase down. Uh, very nice uh, setup for their laundry and ice area. Compared to a lot of other hotels, I've never really seen them done this way. They really separated it from everything else so you don't hear all that noise. Snack machines in here, drink machine, uh, washer dryers, and of course the you know ever necessary ice machine. All located together, all out of the way of everybody else so you're not bothering other people. Nice view of the floor down there. That's the registration booth for the uh, LAS Classic and let's go down the stairs. I personally found the stairs very helpful uh, for you know certain points in time like when a lot of people were getting out of the tournament at the same time when an, a line ended uh, it was usually quicker to take the stairs of course there's not that many people staying in the hotel uh, a lot of people were staying off-site but you know it is a nice option to have and they really do uh, set the staircase up very nicely and it's easy to traverse now we're going to continue down here and go past the front desk and I'm going to show you some other portions of uh, the Spooky Nook complex outside of the warehouse at the Nook. Alright, so from here you can go one of two ways, either right or left. But first we're going to take a look at the outside of the building here. Uh, that's what some of the, you know, rooms uh, look out to. You don't see outside, but you see into the complex. It's kind of a neat, uh, neat feel to it. It's definitely different. And we took uh, the route to the left. This is the back side of the restaurant that we will check out later. And now we're headed to the field house. This is where the Lancaster Classic was held. 
as you can see, you know, it's all set up here. Uh, looking great, getting all ready for all these archers to come and shoot. A nice uh, top view here, you know, quite a picture, especially once it's filled up with archers shooting. Really a beautiful sight to see. And then a quick pan on the other side too, checking out the vendors and additional targets, including the finals venue. And now let's check out the right side of the building, the non-archery side of the building, at least for our tournament that was here. Uh, this is filled with rock climbing, a smoothie bar, uh, there's basketball courts, there's uh, field hockey, soccer, pretty much you name it, they have it going on here. Uh, there's even some shopping, uh, there's an arcade. So they go all out here and uh, this happens to be at not peak hours. I went uh, back this way uh, later during the weekend and it was packed, you know, full of families and stuff, having a great time, full of sporting events and things. So uh, lots to see here, lots to do, uh, very, very cool. And with all that running around, it was time to eat. So here is the uh, main restaurant at uh, the warehouse at the Nook. So just walking through, going to get some uh, food. Time to order something, and food of choice. Uh, I believe this is the Smokehouse Burger. Uh, you know, I love my hamburgers, so here you go, mmm. Thank you for watching, hope you enjoyed this video, and as always, happy shooting.